always the only, only woman in the room. Mm. Still walk in, only woman in the room. And there's a room full of white men, usually older. Um, thrills me, just thrills me. <laughs> I, just, I just love it. <laughs> um, usually the only black person in the room. Also, never really concerned me because I, I don't look at people through color. I didn't get to be where I am by, and who I am by looking at uh, the color of people's skin. I really, literally took Martin Luther King at his word uh, and understand that the content of a person's character and refuse to let anybody else do that to me. So I love it, just <laughs> love it. And um, there's a wonderful phrase by Maya Angelou from a poem that she wrote called, um, to our grandmothers, that she says, when I come as one, but I stand as 10,000. So when <clears> I walk into a room, and particularly before I have something really challenging to do, or I'm gonna be in a circumstance where I feel I'm going to be you know, up against um, some difficulties, I will literally sit and I will call on that 10,000. Mm -hmm. I will call on the, the ancestors. I will call on those people who've come before me. I will call on the women who forged a path that I might be able to sit in the room with all of those white men and love it so much. Uh, I, 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 call on, I call on that right. because I know that my being where I am, and first of all, being who I am and where I am didn't come just out of myself, that I come from a heritage. And so I own that mm -hmm. and I step into that room, not just as myself, but I bring all of that, 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 that energy with me. Mm -hmm.